Okay, hello, hello everyone. Maybe wondering why I'm making this video. I'm making it for one person who replied to a random comment I made on some post. Um, and he asked um, how to fix the controls in the Switch version of Terraria. So I shall um, help you with that. Basically, obviously you want to go here and edit. So this is the basic controls. I use X to open inventory because that's what you use in most games like this and B to close inventory because B means back. You obviously use the L joystick to navigate the inventory because, <laughs> I mean, that just makes sense. Um, I use L and R to cycle bumper buttons. Um, what switch the world mean? Oh well, that was the default, so I'm leaving it like that. The navigate inventory secondary is the D-pad. Now movement, L. Jump. Now, those of you who haven't played Terraria, may seem weird, but this jump was the default. And I got used to playing it like that, so I left it like that. To interact is B. You basically just put your cursor over something so it's B. And L and R to cycle the hot bar. B is grapple, A is quick mount, that's not, not as the original, but it works pretty well. And I decided to change all the D-pad things since those are um, for our stuff. So aim is R stick, obviously. Use item is ZR, which is also so quick heal is Y. That's the thing I got used to the old update, so you wanna do that. Um quick buff is R plus ZR. It was originally a D-pad thing, but I changed it. Now, at this point, you may be wondering, well, how do I do something? Well, you want to press, go something, press the button you currently have to select something, which I'm assuming will be A, then press your button or combination of buttons. Choice. And if you want to make something unbound, just go to it and press Y. And that works. I don't know if it's a different button. So, um... This is what the commenters ask about. You see, this is what it was before 1.4. But in 1.4, this got switched to R and this got switched to L. So what you wanna do is press A, press no, press down on the left stick like that. Um, and same thing with the R stick here. Um, and yeah, I think those are pretty much the important ones. Let me look. Oh yeah, you can change toggle chat if you want. You can change zoom in and zoom out. So yeah, that's basically it. Um, you wanna go down here and press apply. I'm actually gonna click discard because I'm worried it might have made some changes. And yeah, that's basically it. You could also change the interface layout. And remember to get rid of all your gravestones, but that part there's no shortcut to. You just gotta have to deal with it. It's something you have to do. I'm sorry. It took me a while, but I did it. Look at how clean. Oh, and I also cleaned the hello as well. So now it's all green. I got a contaminator. I also beat Plantera. But anyways, if you're that one commenter, you can click off now. Nothing important, but please stay and watch anyway. I'd love to have a review on how good I am. Is he? Terraria YouTuber. I'm not a Terraria YouTuber, I'm like a Delta YouTuber. I just play Terraria. <laughs> um, so, um, I can't find the temple, basically. The jungle temple. I looked all over, as you can tell, all over the jungle. I mean, just look. Look at that, that's crazy. And I couldn't find it. So I've decided, screw the temple, who needs that to beat the game? You mean, you mean there's a required boss called Golem in there? Who cares? I'm gonna go check out the dungeon. Because I have nothing else to do with my rapid. Also, it never said this person arrived, but I see some cyborg person. Now I don't remember that cyborg person. Maybe they were here before? I don't know. Also, I don't know if I showed you this in the video, but I have a cat. I have a cute kitty cat. I have shown you it in the Plantera video. It's cute. It's a cute cat. Okay, go pet the cat. Um, so yeah, this is the cyborg. And oh, whatever. It doesn't matter. I also got a tax collector. So somebody there. 
Anyways, also, if any of you know how to spot a truffle, I'm trying to make a surface mushroom biome here. But he isn't spotting in this house, and I can't figure out why. Is it because the background's made of wood? I don't know. What was that noise? Did you guys just hear a noise too? Maybe it was just me. I hear noises sometimes. I'm crazy. I think I'm crazy. Do you think I'm crazy? Tell me in the comments if you think I'm crazy. Because I clearly am crazy. I'm mentally deranged. Ha <laughs> ha, just kidding. Man, my jokes are not not very nice towards myself. My, my jokes are not, not kind of weird. Okay, I should stop those weird jokes. So I can't really it. Oh, and also I got this new sword. I didn't tell you about that. I really hope I can find the jungle temple soon because, um, thing is, in there are the things required to craft solar eclipse and stuff. That would be really useful. Please. So I'm heading in the dungeon. Whee! So let me get out my hollow key. Also, Plantera's dropped some, by the way. Like, none of them are, are, are good. Anyway, so I can get Ectoplasm. that get this pumpkin and frost. I also need to use my hollow to get something. Oh yeah, these guys are tough. Look at how much health that guy. What? There's another enemy? I have to beat two enemies? So the enemies drop a ghost. That drops the enemy. I mean, I don't. Lucky tally counter. It's a lucky tally counter. Interesting. Blaze how many monsters have been killed. And oh my goodness. That is a giant curse spell. My goodness. This is kind of scary. I might die. Time's over. Yeah, party time's over, of course. First party time. Can you look at what I'm doing. <laughs> Robbing the grave. I got a wisp in a bottle. Um, what does that mean? What are wisps in a bottle? I assume it's useful for something. Oh, I also crafted that Avengers set for this thing. Stuff like that. I, I, I just want to tell you all the stuff I've done. And by the way, if that commenter is still here, thank you for staying, and I have died. Okay, so that's the dungeon. It's, it's good. Yeah, yeah, it's good. Wisp in a bottle summons a wisp to provide light. Huh. Hmm. What is that achievement though? Robbing the grave, that's it. Obtain a rare treasure from a difficult mob in the dungeon. Okay. Well, I definitely did that, so. Um, 
Okay, crafting. Naughty present. You can make specter bars. Okay, I'll probably make some specter bars. This is a mithril anvil. This is a mithril anvil. And this is an adamantite forge. Right, sorry it cut out, guys. Does that sometimes. Um, I'm gonna see about crafting that naughty present, I think. Not gonna use it. Alright. Maybe not. Um, let's just craft specter bars right now and see what I can craft with that. Although I do want to craft a naughty present because I assume that will be very much fun. Where's my chlorophyte? Chlorified. I don't want mithril. I want chlorified. It's a green one. Do 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 Need my claw fight. There it is. Right now, let's see what we can craft with a specter bar. And then I'm thinking we might go down to Spiderland to get some silk and then. Craft a naughty present. I'm probably gonna. You see, there's some slight lag when I'm recording the videos. So I'm thinking I might just save the naughty present until not only am I prepared to use it, but just like in general, like. Let's see, so armor, a paintbrush. I guess. A drill containment unit? Yeah, I saw about that, but I need something called Luminite, when I have no clue how to get Luminite. Spectre wings. Flight and supply. I'm kind of fine with my ice wings. So yeah, overall, it just... Wait, what? What the heck? These, this armor sucks, so I just have to save my spectre bars. For, um, basically whatever that drill containment unit thing is. Nice, some cash. I needed some cash, you know that? I needed some cash. Some cash. I actually think I'm just gonna end the